the principal of Hall High School is talking about the Little Rock School District takeover tonight, saying they're doing all they can to make the school the best it can be. The National Education Association president visiting the school today, saying a bigger national testing problem is to blame and that a state takeover has not worked in other states. Channel 7's Alicia Dover live outside the Clinton School of Public Service tonight, where the NEA president is scheduled to speak. Alicia. That's right, the NEA president and other school leaders saying today that they're optimistic about the future of education. National Education Association President Lily Garcia asking students at Hall High School Monday to voice what they think can be done to improve their school. This is opportunity. Asking many of them in Spanish and for an important reason. She says many of them English second language students are being tested in English after only one year of learning the language. I want to show you that I'm more than my test score, and they are. The Hall High School principal agrees that holding schools to only test scores could be hurting them, especially for international students. It is unfair for these students to be expected to do high-level work when they're coming to us and at that low level. It takes more than a year to get those students up to the par that other students have had 12 and 13 years to do. He says even though they're labeled a distressed school in a district taken over by the state last week, they're trying hard to overcome it. Well, I think anytime you put a negative con connotation on someone, they're going to feel it. Garcia says they've researched other instances of state takeovers, and it hasn't gone well in other states. When it's their plan, they work it, and they don't want to fail. They want it to succeed. So it changes the atmosphere when it comes from within. Garcia is about to speak here at the Clinton School. She was already scheduled to visit here before the state takeover of the Little Rock School District. Back to you. Alicia Dover live tonight and Hall is one of six schools in the Little Rock School District that was labeled as distressed.